Hey folks, Ryan Stowell from Elegant Exteriors. Wanted to reach out and touch base with you guys in regards to one of the most popular questions and requests that we get, especially in the summertime, which is homeowners who are looking for ways to cool their attic and requesting us to specifically install an attic fan. And one of the things that uh, we so often encounter when we go to uh, look and evaluate whether or not um, an attic fan is the proper method for ventilating, ventilating an attic space is that homeowners will oftentimes have ridge vent on their roof um, and they're also looking for the installation of an attic fan. Now the problem here is that uh, ventilation is probably one of the most crucial elements for the longevity of your roof and proper ventilation is even more important. Um, I, ideally, ridge vent is designed to work along with ventilation systems that are installed at the eve of your uh, roof. Uh, so the soffit that you'll see that extends out over the eave uh, will typically have holes in it and be ventilated soffit which allows for air to uh, be taken in through that soffit and uh, provide as a method for uh, air to come in and uh, cool off the attic in the summer months. However, equally as important is a way for that air to also escape. Ridge vent is installed at the ridge of a roof and it's installed by cutting a couple inches on either side of the ridge um, and then installing a ventilation system on top of that and then the caps go on top of that ventilation system. And as the air comes in through your soffit, it uh, will obviously heat inside the attic, rise to the peak of the roof and then be expelled out through that ridge. When you install an attic fan in areas where a ridge vent is already installed, you are actually creating the, the reverse effect to happen. And what starts to happen is when the attic fan turns on, uh, when the thermostat activates the fan to, to, to turn on, air starts to get drawn from the attic space. However, if you have ridge vent installed in that same attic area, the, uh, the, the current of air that's being drawn into the attic will start to pull air in through the actual ridge vent at the ridge of the roof. And this acts, uh, it, it basically acts uh, in the opposite effect of what you're really trying to have occur, which is for uh, air to naturally come in through the attic, rise to the peak of the roof, and then be expelled out. And so these two systems are not meant to be designed or to, to be installed in the same attic space. So when you're uh, looking to cool off your attic in the summer months, installing an attic fan isn't necessarily the best option. And uh, any roofer who's going to come to the house and not evaluate the insulation, the attic space, the square footage, the type of ventilation that's currently installed on the roof today as a way to try to determine what the best next steps are is really doing you an injustice and a disservice. And so uh, it's important that you, uh, if you're looking to cool off the attic, that you reach out to certified contractors. Uh, we're certified with Owens Corning and GAF, uh, where the education that we've received to make sure that your attic is properly ventilated, um, we're experts, um, not just someone who's going to do what you ask them to do, which may not necessarily be the right thing to do for your roof. So look forward to helping you this summer. Uh, roof replacements, roof repairs, uh, please reach out to us if you have any questions at 256-NEW-ROOF. Uh, we look forward to helping you. Thanks a lot.